Hi, this is David or Dave once again and welcome to my YouTube channel. This video presentation will be again a sort of a return to my roots where I'll be discussing again something computer related. In particular, I will be wrapping up the Western Digital MyCloud uh, related uh, playlist that I have created and already added and of course naturally recorded, uploaded uh, the two videos that are residing there, the disassembly and reassembly guide. So this video will be the final closing piece on that matter. So this video presentation is basically just a sort of a notification or uh, information disclosure as such where you can download on the internet your very own so-called virgin disk images for the MyCloud single bay NAS hard drive from Western Digital. The download link or the folder link where these uh, images are located that is placed in the description part of the video so you don't have to stretch your eyes out in this video presentation or to make out the URL address in my web browser that is all provided in the description box of the video. So what are the images that I'm providing? I am sharing the 2 terabyte, the 3 and the 4 terabyte virgin disk image and the latter are provided in two formats. One is of course naturally the bare naked IMG file. This will probably be too much for you to download because the size of each individual image is almost 5 gigabytes, 4.9. But then I have also compressed each individual image respectively with the 7-zip program. So I'm also providing or sharing the compressed uh, version of these individual images as well. And these ones are much smaller. Uh, only the 4 terabyte uh, image is almost at the size of a an older uh, CD, it's almost 650 megabytes. But the 2 and the 3 terabyte images are much smaller, so that will be much easier for you to download them. For easy access and discernment, I have uh, renamed, regardless of the format, whether it is a compressed or uncompressed version, I have renamed each individual image accordingly so that you know which one do you want or you are downloading so an example for the 3 terabyte image WD my cloud 3 tb vdi dot img so vdi signifies virgin disk image maybe that is completely uh, too much but nevertheless so then when you download either the compressed uh, version or the img as such you just simply rename it to my cloud and leave the IMG uh, suffix as such so that you can then do the necessary procedure in System Rescue CD or Ubuntu or whatever uh, Linux live distribution that you'll be using in order to soft hard the break or just simply upgrade the hard drive in your NAS uh, WD My Cloud enclosure. Perhaps another note on the compressed uh, version of the images, I have not password protected them so no password uh, system is in place. The parameters that are used are the following. Uh, I use the ultra compression level method. Uh, of course, the archive format is 7Z or 7Zip, and I've used the LZMA2 compression method. I left all of the other parameters as such unchanged. Uh, let's say that you have a 6 terabyte and an 8 terabyte. WD My Cloud, and you want to make a virgin disk image of thereof or the snapshot of the hard drive when it came from the retail seller or the factory as such. I'll also provide the link to that in the description part of the video as well. And if you decide to do this, you can also hit me up in the comment section below, notify me that you want to uh, share this image, and I'll make the necessary uh, prerequisites on how we can make the exchange if you want. So I can add the existing two missing virgin disk images to my roster. So hit me up in the comment section below or in, in the discussion page on my channel. But you can also private message me through the YouTube private messaging system as well. Now if you have virgin disk images uh, of other capacities as well, I would also be gladly to accept them. So let's say, I don't know, 10, 12 terabytes if you have such a hard drive of such capacity in your WD My Cloud and if you want to make a virgin disk image of that 
also you can hit me up notify me that you want to share it and I'll gladly add it to the existing bunch that I have but also I'm not limited on the downward scale so let's say that you decided to put in a two terabyte WD My Cloud Enclosure a one terabyte hard drive and you use the two terabyte image and shrunk the ext4 partition in order to fit it onto the hard drive so the operating system boots nicely and everything and if you want to share a one terabyte virgin disk image hell you can hit me up as well and notify me you want to share that too or even if you did something even more crazy you installed a 500 gigabyte solid state system into a uh, two terabyte my cloud enclosure model and uh, you also managed to get the virgin image from a two terabyte working on a 500 gigabyte solid state drive and you want to share that image uh, the virgin one as well sure hit me up notify me and i'll add that as well to the existing roster of virgin disk images as well no problem description part of the video i'll be also relinking uh, the two guides from wd community forum on how to soft or hard debrick or unbreak your single bay wd my cloud nas device or even if you want to just simply upgrade hard drive or downgrade it in that uh, manner as well uh, this guide can be used in either form and i'll also be adding this one as well if you don't already know about them but probably already do so after you have uh, acquired the correct or the necessary virgin disk image for the my cloud of your choice you definitely want to uh, make or use a bootable usb thumb drive in order to carry out the operation in let's say system rescue cd or ubuntu or other similar linux live distributions uh, there are many programs out there that will create your usb thumb drive bootable and i personally have been using uh, rufus here for quite some time and it's very easy you don't have to install it it's a standalone executable file so be sure to check it out as well now i have personally tested the two and the three terabyte virgin disk image and both are at least in my example when i was uh, doing some soft hard debricking or just simply upgrading the hard drive when i was fiddling around with the enclosure for the three terabyte wd nas my cloud enclosure they were confirmed to be working uh, i don't know about the four terabyte image so if it doesn't work let me know in the comment section below if it does you know also notify me that would be great a uh, good reference for other users as well now if you don't trust the compressed uh, version disk images or even the uncompressed versions as well the img files you can always if you want upload the files to online uh, antivirus scanners websites that exist and uh, be certain in that manner as well that everything that I share is virus free uh, no Trojan horse attached and similar so I'll probably add this website into the description part of the video as well so that's it so this is pretty much the end of this video presentation on where you can get your own version disk image for the my cloud of your choice depending on regardless of what you're doing whether you just want to soft the break or hard the break your WD my cloud device or you want to upgrade uh, the hard drive inside where you can get those version disk images because uh, when I was recently uh, scourging or looking through the WD community forum, I was uh, clicking on old uh, mega uh, links. Therefore, I was actually surprised that I wasn't able to find any of the existing version disk images out there. But then I remembered because I'm a stacker by nature. Uh, accidentally, a couple of days ago, I found out uh, that on one of my external hard drives, I had uh, these version disk images, all three of them. So the two, three and four terabyte version. And I said, well, why not let's share them at one place under one roof. So here they are. If you need them, 
the link is in the description part of the video in the end i have some of my links for the images uh, whether it is compressed or uncompressed they will stop working they will be deleted uh, let me know comment section below uh, discussion page on my youtube channel you can also private message me and also if you want to share other capacity wise version disk images that you've made or you want to do uh, hit me up as well i'll uh, try to help you in in the best way that i can other than that like share subscribe and we'll see you in another video very soon this is david or dave saying goodbye